Dear Capricorn, welcome to my channel. My name is Levy and I'm going to do tarot reading for you for next week, for the last week of July. Uh, thank you for watching. If you enjoy this video, hit the like button uh, below, subscribe. And uh, with that, let's get going. I'll shuffle the card, open up for you. And let's see what the universe wants to tell you to dear Capricorn friend for next week. Okay. Right, so the first thing first. You are being led by your intuition. And that's good. Keep it that way, okay? <clears throat> because it seems like, well, this is right here, the High Priestess. She knows the answer. So High Priestess is intuition, is, is the knowledge, it's a universal knowledge, is something that inside you. It's not outside there, it's something inside you who always, oh, that thing that always get the right things done without thinking, without um, working out, is just feel it, okay? This is feelings, emotions. Why I'm saying this? Because there are quite a few um, cards in here that suggest that you are putting yourself into a mental prison, putting yourself into a trap. The trap that doesn't exist is just you made it up by thoughts, creating walls around you by thoughts. Maybe because of uh, previous um, bad experiences, maybe uh, disappointment, maybe because uh, um, something is not going the right way in your life, but everything, those mental struggles are being created by you. They are not there and they're not meant to be there. And you should be going out from them by following your heart, following what you feel inside uh, because you keep yourself prisoner. You might have headaches, nightmares, uh, sleepless night over something that can be sorted if you listen to your inner voice. You listen to that angel on your uh, shoulder, not the devil on the other devil on the other shoulder, and you know you are pretty strong and pretty stable. So I have here the the emperor for you in this corner, and I have here the magician for you up there. So you have the talent to manifest what's up there in your head and to bring it down and put it into your subconscious so the pattern is changes you have the 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 talent and you have the knowledge the experience how to manifest something from all four plateaus the mental the physical the emotional and the spiritual as well and and bring it down into reality so if you can bring those down and make it a product, make it a service, make it, make it something that people, it could be tangible in that form as well, or digital, it doesn't really matter. Um, but something that was non-existent, it was only an idea, become reality. And that reality and that, that um, path together penetrates your subconscious and override um, bad programming. It's like, oh, it's not possible. I will never be able to do that. How is it possible? How can I do? Uh, I'm not good enough. I'm not not uh, knowledgeable enough. Where well, the magician is, the magician knows without studying certain things. It's just it's just there. It's it's ability. It's an ability. It's a talent. It's there. It's not explanation. It's not logical. It doesn't have to be logical, because it can be just, just, just there. Oh, I know how to do it. How is it? How is it possible? And you never studied that. 
well i don't know i just feel it i feel it how it's being done and your intuition inside tells you what's the right answer what needs to be done how it needs to be um, carried out okay so i would suggest to to um leave the memory land leave the place where you we think about the good things in the past and how everything was and then so comfortable and happiness and everything in the past because that doesn't serve you anymore the six of cups uh, warning you that get out of the past let's focus on the future go to calmer shore uh, and and leave all that things behind that does not serve you anymore you might have some bruises you might have some headaches from work studies um business related stuff but but this this is all knowledge learned experience gained uh, understanding um and everything what comes comes with the with the, with the expertise so this uh, this is good uh, focus on that what you have already learned don't focus on what is no longer serving you okay Think about your inner child, that little uh, young fellow that needs attention and needs love, caring. Because it seems like in a, a lately you have been investing a lot of time, energy, even money into something to, to make something happen and you forget about your, your, uh, your soul, your, your, uh, that little inner child who needs, who needs attention, you need love, caring so um maybe by the end of the week you might want to go out and celebrate a little bit just just celebrate life you know get together with the girls or with the boys or me whatever and just just get out of of the everyday things get out of the grind and just go and, and, and enjoy yourself just just celebrate a little bit your your um, the achievements there is a lot there are a lot of achievements have been done there are a lot of work have been done a lot of headache a lot of grind now it's time to just give yourself a break right this is what it is give yourself a little break it's not forever it's not it's not for but at least for a weekend or for a couple of days just 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 switch off switch off go out don't gossip and you know don't just you know spend your time wisely it's quality time basically this is what it is with people you love being together maybe you have friends you know who used to go out together and and they haven't seen them lately because it's so much work coming in maybe it's time to re re reunite you know get 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 them together let's let's get out of because the temperance saying it's life is about balance you have to balance things in your life work um family life studying um exercise you know, like make all these a bit more a bit more uh, sustainable so you don't burn out because burning out is is it's not so what's the point if you burn out what's the gain if you burn out um because maybe if you step back a little bit you realize like most of the work has been done and some other other people can actually um uh, finish if necessary this is celebration this is uh people looking up on you and and you are the victor you are victorious that means the lot of work is done and now you just have to take the reward so step back get ready for some fun because it's about time let yourself lose a little bit let yourself uh, go out a little bit just you know good food a bit of drinks something social something more uh, um, uplifting we all need something like that like we, we need we can't just just work all day long every single day you have you have to do that and uh, hangman saying here yes i've been hanged in here for too long far too long it's now time to get out do something uh, and you know what's the funny thing will be the funny thing will be everything will take care of itself even if you walk out for a little bit even if you take a break somehow things just gonna work out so you thinking you need to be there and without you nothing works and well uh, have you ever seen a magician working really hard 
like really uh, beating its craft well not visibly not uh, it's it's just have the knowledge that's it you have the knowledge you know how to make things happen and become reality so i suggest to give yourself a little break work smart not hard especially when you reach a certain uh, stage it's much more beneficial for the long term and you will be able to achieve more delegate the work uh, just just show the way to somebody who can do it and just let them do it and you have a little fun okay so with that dear capricorn uh, let me give you a couple of cards from the sacred destiny oracle as well hope you enjoyed if you did hit the like button and let's see what the cards are saying for you for next week so this is focus this is new beginnings and this is adventures well the focus here i think um it's about time to shift your focus to something else to a new beginning so rather than focus on what you are doing what you've been doing i think it's time to sort of take the focus back and and shift it and and focus on something else so new beginnings um, are possible if you change a little bit okay and adventures this is the one i was talking about the inner child is is excited he wants to do something different he wants to have fun he wants to experience something new so make that happen with the new beginnings and adventures things are coming into your life so make the most of it okay have fun enjoy and um, with that, thank you very much for watching. I hope uh, I gave you a little insight and uh, some extra support. Please hit the like button and I will see you in the next one. Dear Capricorn, thank you very much. Bye.